we had another quarterfinal finish. Which one? Uh, Riku. That's the one we've Play just looked at, isn't it? Oh no, What's yeah. That? Okay. Yeah, Riku versus Play One Two Five. Two, three, four, five. <clears throat> okay, it's working again now. Okay. I want to sleep. Why? It's only half nine there. Uh. I don't know. <laughs> it's early. <laughs> I know. <laughs> okay, so Riku won that one. Um. How is the tournament got, going? We've got Riku okay. versus player one, two, three, four, five that has finished. I guess you have to go uh, play that one. So I think it can quite wild for people to finish up the last games. It's yes, loads. finally got the <laughs> game loaded before you even before you start picking. Yay! <laughs> So uh picks for player one two three four five. He goes for one in uh Janub Al Sharia, then two three four in the center, uh five in uh in that pink plus four, as I guess is a combo or counter to Akasin, then the six up in the north, also as a counter, and seven and eight in the south. Mm. I guess picks are not okay. So not so keen on the six. <coughs> He's already got good coverage there in the middle. Mm -hmm. I don't see why. And that's a that's a three turn bonus, so I don't I don't like the six. Okay, yeah, that's like valid. <laughs> Take a look at Riku's picks and Riku goes for one in the south, then two and three in the center, uh, four in Asir, uh, then a five in Al Qasim, uh, six also as a counter in the north, <laughs> they really like that counter. And then the yeah. seven and eight also were counters around the center. So mostly position. Yeah. Let's see what they got. And yeah, they split the center. Uh, player has safety in the south. And then they also split that plus one with the plus two. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's just play this, see what happens. I'm gonna play the game starting now. <coughs> and it seems that Rico doesn't risk getting the other plus two at all. Or he misclicked. Why the hell did he deploy so much there? Why did he. Uh. He went south. Yeah, I think that was a mistake. Like what the hell is going on? <laughs> yeah, this is not looking good for Riku. <clears throat> Riku does break the plus two, but he loses. He gets. Loses a double border on his plus two in the south. I'm not sure why Riku moved to Alcon. Me neither. Who knows? Yeah, that's <coughs> Maybe he was drunk. <laughs> Really risky take there. Yeah, game's yeah. over. That's yeah, player That's just breaks everything. Yeah. Bad luck, Riku. Good game. Player one, two, three, four, five. Okay. How's the tournament going? Uh, I guess we can take a break and wait for the final to end. Otherwise, this is gonna get very boring. Yeah. 
<laughs> okay. <clears throat> so I guess we'll do like a five minute break. Um, yeah, and see you, see you guys soon. Just gonna get okay. some water or something. Okay. Hey, if people on the chat yeah. want us to talk about anything in, in particular, like any updates on Warlight or something, just uh, let us know. Otherwise, we'll just wait for the tournament to play out. Probably update for launch. Um, yep. Yes, uh, the winner between David and Zarahosta was Zarahosta. Yeah. Paniotis. Beat Semis. Um, Bucky built beats Master Rero. Semis? What Semis? There was no Semis. What are you talking in the, about? In the same rounds, in the same rounds that David, that Zara beat David. That's already all filled out. Semis. We're just waiting for the semi-finals okay. now. Alright. Okay, I'll leave this on the stream and I'll be back in a few minutes. She seems okay. uh camera stopped working again. <laughs> Let me try to fix yeah, that first. Person. Okay, that's working again. Okay, so we'll be right back. <laughs> I've got pizza here, so I'm going to eat this quietly and <laughs> mute my mic. I go into my game at in final right now. Game finished. I think you can review it.
Did somebody just park his uh, automobile in his uh, living room? <laughs> I think that's uh, Panna. It's Paniotis's mic. <laughs> Maybe. I mean, we call these people kangaroos here, like kangaroos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think. Yeah, I gotta head off. I gotta go get some food. You can ride Panagiotis' bike. I can do what? Ride his bike? Yeah, <laughs> ride his bike. He's chopper. <laughs> <laughs> like, we can you take fan fiction and uh, said, uh, whose bike is this? This is not a bike, this is a chopper. Whose chopper is this? <laughs> See you, Jeff. See you guys later. Good luck to you too. See ya. Goodbye. Thanks. Okay, I've finished my pizza. <laughs> Sorry, dear, I can't hear you now. I've finished my pizza. I just left it. Ate it in about two minutes. <laughs> I think PS has died. Well, he probably dives inside his toilet. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> OPS is alive, I just saw movements on the camera. <laughs> Don't die, PS! You could have at least put your camera on Laku while you were gone. Hello, I'm back.
You could have at least put your camera on Laku while you were gone. <laughs> I yeah, I could have. We we'll still have both semi-finals are still going. So guys, you guys are so slow. I know. Yeah, they, they're stalling. They're stalling yeah. on ladders. They're stalling on WGL. Yeah. Enough. Yeah, but you're thinking a lot. <laughs> One day is the maximum. Should be the maximum. <clears throat> I think you're stalling, glamorous. Uh, who says the, the, this kind of lies? <laughs> I'm checking if people said anything interesting on the chat, but apparently no. No, they've all booked off. Oh. 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 <laughs> okay. I, w I was about to say embarrassing, but uh, it is uh, GG actually. I will just type embarrassing it inside. Yeah, I ask him to surrender his world. That always works. <laughs> I'm sorry, Pan, but I hope Kezo wins. <laughs> uh, Master of the Dead, if you're hearing, do you want to join us and talk something about the multi-day ladder? Or are you also bored to death like us? <laughs> One master of the dead. And MOTD actually said to ask Panagiotis to mute his microphone when he isn't talking, so we don't hear that helicopter sound. <laughs> I said that I'm, I'm trying to think. You can't understand me. <laughs> yeah, the helicopter sound is him thinking. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> that's <laughs> Seems one of the semi-finals are done. Yes, and if you look at my game, you will see that uh, that one army bonus actually counted in the end of the game. I think I'm going to win. Win, my win, game. win. Okay, shall we review player 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 versus Glamorous, since it's sure. finished? Oh, Glam, you lost. Why? Oh, don't spoil. I said embarrassing. Uh, so Glamorous, do you want to go over your picks? Uh, yes, I wanted to make a, a combo around... Uh, okay, so I picked the obvious pick in the center as first. Mm -hmm. Then my second and third are uh, the kind of safe in the south. Then four and five in the east. The red bonus was sat as Sarikia and mm. uh, Samalal Sarikia. In the purpose of completing the four army bonus uh, soon enough. Mm. Then uh, my sixth was the Asir bonus near the Red Sea. Seven was the one army bonus Chizan. And eight was the counter in the combination in the southwest. But my goal was to go for the risky pick in the in the bonus uh, in the Persian calf. Okay, and now we should have Master of the Dead also online. Except we don't hear him. Yeah. Dead man, are you Hi. there? We can't hear you. Can't hear me. Hello. Turn oh, you're way Hello. you're way too low. You're very quiet. Yeah, you need to speak up or get a better mic. <coughs> yeah, we can't hear you at all. On, there's a boost option <coughs> on mic settings if you right click. Yeah, Stix is an expert on mic settings by now, so she yeah, can she can help you. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, we're gonna take a look at player one, two, three, four, five picks, and he picks Sorry, one. Picks he player I'm one, two, three, four, five picks one in the uh, Al Shar Ar Rihat in the center. Then the two in Janu Vasharkia, so the same one two as Glamorous, but his three is in Najran, also as Glamorous, I think. That his four is actually in Jabala, and then his five is on uh, Wasat Asharkia. So uh, they had similar idea, just different picks. And player one to three for five also has a very safe eight pick up in the north. <coughs> which you should probably put earlier, I guess, but uh, well, whatever. So let's see what they got. 
Um, Earlier? Yeah. And it seems... What? <clears throat> the 8 pick earlier with the wasteland there? I don't understand what you mean. The wasteland yeah, it has a wasteland, yeah, in Lima. No, I didn't even notice that. Uh, okay, so Glamorous oh, got... No. Glamorous got his uh, North Cluster, although it's a bit vulnerable from that uh, plus 2 green. So he will yes. have to play it uh, carefully. Uh, so yeah, I think player one to three five might actually have uh, advantage in this game. Yeah, definitely. Um, okay, let's play this and see what happens. I'm gonna play the game starting now. So player tries to do the wipeout and fails. But Glam didn't have a chance to get any income either, and player did get that uh, plus one. Mm -hmm. <coughs> we can afford not to stay alive in Alphara. I think no. player one to three four five might have overexpanded a bit. Oh, over deployed, I mean, on that uh, yellow bonus. Oh, nope, he's trying nope. to actually finish it all. Okay, that's even Hi, more. Okay, can you hear me now? Yeah, yes, can we can hear you. Yeah, crystal clear. Okay. What is that, man? Never guys... die. Yes, what is that, man? Never die. What are you guys talking about? <laughs> we are talking about the game between player 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and Glamorous. Okay. Which player one to three four five has a good advantage, but seems to be trying really hard to still lose it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh my God! I can still hear the helicopter. Why doesn't he mute his microphone? I don't know. When he's not talking. Want to. Bob doesn't it's like. It's really muting. annoying for everyone on the on the stream. The world is watching the stream. Okay. Then. This is why you don't I get mean, any friends, Bob. Yeah, <laughs> now you know. It's not because you're Greek, it's because of that damn microphone. Oh, that's racist. I said it's not because you're Greek. <laughs> Still racist. <laughs> Man, Russian, Russians just don't get anything. Okay, so Glamorous just surrenders after getting... He got a plus four, but he has quadruple border to defend, yeah. so he just decides to surrender. Uh, yeah. Congratulations, player one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> You move on to the next round. And if Bob would finish playing against Kezo, we could even review yeah. that game. Stop stalling, Paniosis. Oh, it's finished. Oh, he has it's finished. finished. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's load that up. <coughs> Wait. Kezo Wait. reached the semi final? How? What? Hack. <laughs> what? How did Alternative Kezo reach facts. The what, he yeah, seriously. Well. What, what universes are we in? He played well and he's an outlaw, so of course he did. Ah, uh, pure luck. <laughs> Boston agrees. <clears throat> so, <laughs> picks, picks for Bob in this game. I know, Bob, are you busy? Can you go over these picks or? Um, I'm muted. I just thinking. I'm just thinking about the final picks, so you can discuss about it. <laughs> okay, okay, so we'll go over <laughs> Kezo's picks. Wait, Kezo... wasn't that a spider? He told us who's in the final. <clears throat> well, if you if you read it out loud like that, then it becomes a spoiler. Yeah. He could, he but, could be I picking mean, for another game. I, I didn't really think Kezo should be in the semi-final to begin with, so it's fine. <laughs> so Kezo picks <gasps> one, one, two, three, four in the Garbal Rihad. And then five six, uh, oh. <laughs> also close. A quadruple cluster. And nice. then seven to counter it, and then eight. So if he misses his quadruple pick, he's dead. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Wow. How how did he get to the semi final? <laughs> <laughs> what is this nonsense? At least he played. <laughs> yeah. We, this is unlike weak. other scaredy cats. <laughs> okay, so I was fixing bugs. 
<laughs> yeah, that good old excuse. I was fixing bugs. No, it bugs. really was. Stuff broke on the clan leak lot. So, <laughs> so uh, picks for Panagiotis. Yeah. He has one so, in uh, Sharura, then two in yeah. the center in uh, Shamal Ariad, then three nice. as a combo uh, in the green on the south, the four as a combo to the orange, then a five uh, as a combo in Al Qasim, then a six in uh, Asir. And then seven and eight in the center for position. Uh, yeah, yeah, these picks are a lot better. I think yeah, he wins on picks without even seeing what they get because he's going to get one central pick, and he's going to get the southern bonuses, and they'll be equal income on at the end of turn one, and then he'll break him. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see if that is true or not. Uh, yeah, they oh. there's a huge counter right in the middle of Kazo's picks, and I would just surrender if I was Kazo because. Yeah, there's, there's no chance he can do anything oh, from this picks. You know, you know what he did. If he was going for that uh, quadruple pick, mm -hmm. I think he needs to make uh, Shamal Ar Riyadh his early pick. It can't be his third pick because, you know, that's like most likely to be picked because it's so central to everything else. Yeah. So picking Al Qasim was like really bad if you wanted to even try the risky quadruple. Yeah. Anyways, let's just play this and see what happens. I'm going to play the game starting now. And Panajet is actually flanks <laughs> to get the plus two. And this will let Kesso finish the plus four. Is he even going to try it? Yeah, he will. Of course he will. He's a locker. <laughs> Yeah, but defending a triple border with the same income. Uh, yeah, it's oh, he even wastes an army by doing an unnecessary late tap. If you want to tap, it needs to be early, I think. Yeah. And now he Big tries problems. to do something weird by deploying everything <laughs> in the north. I guess he's trying to get that plus two behind yeah, yeah. Uh, Panagiotis. And break him at the same time. Yeah, he's just spending more armies on neutrals when he's already behind, so... Oh, he knocks the wrong door. <laughs> and that's game. No, he needs to play one more turn. So this is why it took forever. Yeah. <laughs> Not knowing when to surrender, that's the problem. <laughs> yep. Yeah, but I really like this template. It's um, it's very brawly in in a sense. Uh, so the first time like I played a game on it, uh, and I was like, "Wow, how do I make eight picks on this board?" Because uh, there literally was like nothing to pick. But it turns out to be almost like a full entail kind of game, and it it ends up being fun because it's like cyclic, so you can plan your way around stuff. What were the yeah, it's um... fun. What were the modifications you made to it, Mark? I, I, I actually just... Uh, actually, I don't think my modifications really matter now that I see enough games on it. I changed the wastelands from 10 to 5. I think even that is not useful because you can't... You don't really take wastelands here yeah. at all. Yeah. So I guess it wouldn't have really mattered. <laughs> and we, we've been seeing no picks at all in those uh, plus 6 and plus 4s in the north. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe, maybe it needs to be tweaked a little so that those bonuses come into the game a little bit more. But I don't know how to do it. Because mm -hmm. they seem very isolated. Okay, so congratulations, Bob. You move on to the final against player 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And the Shalom. final is still ongoing. So we just have to wait. Update challenge. Challenge is updated. Okay. So, Master of the Dead, are you going to talk about what changes you've made to the multi-day ladder? Oh, I just added like a bunch of templates. Um, 
I don't know if everyone's going to like all of them though. <laughs> but there there are seven new templates. So hopefully you like some of them and that will keep you happy or appeased and Do you we know, have you more vetoes as well? Yeah, two you more. get two more vetoes. So now that takes it up to seven. So you can veto seven templates out of 46 templates on the ladder. Okay. I'm hoping we can get up to 50, but I, I don't have like other templates which I think are good. So, still fishing. But ideally, I'd like it to be like 50 and 8 vetoes, maybe. And then, you know, you can just... Um, uh, as you add more new templates, you can maybe pull something out. Like 50 seems like a nice round number to have. 50 sounds way too many already, to tell you the truth. <laughs> But, but in a way, it's fun because, um, like, you know, it really doesn't get stale at all. And um, there are just so many templates that you can't keep up in terms of, like, you know... Uh, knowledge. Knowledge about how players react on certain templates and accordingly counter them by watching history. Yeah. Like, here you just play the game now and you don't really bother, like, you know looking at historical patterns of players because there's just not enough because there are 50 templates. So that's yeah. nice. Of course, but if your MOD probably doesn't hold true because he has like 200 games. So <laughs> there, there are enough games to analyze by MOD maybe. But like for normal players, uh, it's not so bad. Yeah, but I mean, as the ladder moves on, we, there will be more games on each template. Yeah, but like, I mean, even right now, if you have 100 games, right, you just have two games on each template on an average, which is like hardly anything to deduce, like, you know, hey, this guy always triple picks or this guy always, um, you know, goes for that bonus or whatever. Mm. Mm -hmm. Did you manage to get the thing fixed on the clots? Which thing? The, um, that thing that broke earlier. The thingy thing. The thing oh, the <laughs> clan leak cloud? Yeah, 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 I fixed yeah. it. Cool. Yeah. It, was, it was a data entry issue, so... So it was your fault? No, actually. Whoever <laughs> entered the data into the sheet, but it could have been me. I don't know. <laughs> Deadman, uh, do we have to hey, uh, join something in uh, to join the clan leak or it is automated? You have to join the game similar to like multi-day ladder where you have to click join and you have three days to do that. Uh, okay, uh, what do the link for it is in the forum. The games get allocated to you automatically. Yeah, you, you you'll be invited to the game. So you just have to click join. It's like, oh. think of a ladder game where you, it didn't start because you had the same color as someone else. Like two years ago. Did you have to join ladder games two years ago? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh. Yes. We keep two learning years, stuff. <coughs> okay. I'm uh, winning on the predictions. Yay. <laughs> I will. I will have to <laughs> good night. Uh, say good night to you because I have to go out. Okay. okay. Goodbye, glamorous. So, Thanks for joining us. Kali it was a pleasure. Good night. Bye, Russian. <laughs> 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 Is the so, final done? No, it's going no. on. Come no. Come on, Mariotis, hurry! Stop, I'm thinking. He's, he's <laughs> playing on his helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> and doing the weather report on the side. Paniutas actually sounds a lot like Riro. I don't know if you guys have heard Riro. Oh no! He sounds Greek! He sounds no. like have you heard Riro? Have you no. heard Riro talk? I didn't no. know Riro yes, was I Russian. I've heard Riro talk. He's no, they sound very similar. No, they don't. Riro sounds um, Indian and yeah. Paniutas sounds Greek. Nah. Actually, I think it's probably because both of them are like uh, quite young. So There's something wrong with your ears. Really? It's too fat. Says the person who's been pinching on a pizza all day. Um, not all day. I, for about two like, minutes, I had three pieces of a pizza. <laughs> 
was it was it this pizza wait let me give you an image <laughs> three pieces no, of this pizza it wasn't a huge pizza no <laughs> I found it. I'll link it on Skype. So Kizu is sad that we didn't go over his game with the uh, Zara Zara Hustra. Well, we still can. While we're waiting for the final. Well, we no, could. No, it was that pizza. I then, wish. <laughs> that, that would imply opening stuff. <laughs> Did you see the pizza? You have to see I the pizza. I saw it. It was like the size of a house. <laughs> <laughs> we used to actually go to this place in New York where, like, you know, it was, um, you get, like, super cheap pizza and we were in college broke as hell. So <laughs> it's a nice place to go eat. You lived on pizza. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> pizza here is um, quite expensive compared to the States. Like, here, Domino's is one of the best pizzas you can get. But in America, apparently Domino's is horrible and tastes like cardboard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I thought Domino's really tasted like bad here. as well here, but whatever. In Portugal? <laughs> it yeah, actually Domino's. tastes really good in India. I, I never tried it here in Portugal. i seen that they ex ex it exists, but I never tried it, so I don't know. It it's might be so great. It's here, like... I, I order it like once every couple of months at, at the at least. What I'd Turtle says Domino's is good in the US. No way. I don't know. I don't really like Domino's. No, I've not heard a lot of Americans say that. They always say that um, the proper Italian places are better. Yeah, fast fast pizza places are always handmade. not that good. You want a proper yeah. Italian restaurant. The ones that mm -hmm. handmade hand hand make all the pizzas and that. Yeah. Or in brick ovens. Yeah. Quality. How long have you guys been streaming? Why you guys sound quite bored or tired? Well, I, I'm sick, so I'm I'm. Well, Pierre I was already dying. bored. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I already died like five times today, so. And I think all our ears are knackered from the uh, Paniosis's uh, yeah, motorbike or chopper or whatever. <laughs> but luckily, we have the dead man to entertain us now. <laughs> yeah, sing, sing, daddy. Sing, no way. <laughs> <laughs> I, I am see. surprised you're. I'm surprised you're not gloating today. Gloating? Why? Why do you think? What happened today? I wonder. You won a game over her or something? You, no. No. They don't play anymore. She, she's not good enough. She I won't, she would he won't play she's not. with me. He won't play. <laughs> I have elite standards, and I refuse to play with such people. Mm. Yeah, that's why I beat you last time we played. <laughs> Did you know? <laughs> I don't even remember when it was. It seemed like I it have no French recollection of that incident. French yeah, it brawl didn't game. Happen. I remember it. Alternate well. facts. That's, that's what <laughs> Um, But yeah, you should be gloating today. I should be gloating today. Yeah. Oh, why wait, Liverpool you... lost. Yeah, exactly. They did? <laughs> awesome! I didn't even know! Yes. I love how my day keeps getting better every oh, time I hear stuff about Liverpool. I can't believe how crap we're playing! Haha, <laughs> who did Losing you lose to today? Hull! Hull! Haha, <laughs> nice. It's just ridiculous! It's but like to be fair, they're actually in playing a row quite well. Lost. They're playing quite well since they got a new manager, so... <sighs> just shouldn't be happening. Ha, ha. Did you have 80% possession as well? Because that totally makes my day. <laughs> I don't know, maybe. I haven't looked. <laughs> kind of nice. turned it off about 20 minutes before the end, because it was just weak. <laughs> <coughs> I hate it, don't watch games to the end. Yeah, well, I was just, just can't stand annoyed. the massacre. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> Linverson says make someone say Mississippi. Actually, there was a good joke behind it, but the problem was that I actually said it instead of spelt it. So, 
you know, he caught on to what I said and just repeated it. But if I would have spelled it, he would have really messed that up. <laughs> True story. Um, and the final is still not done. Wow. Uh, a final. Isn't Paniotis in the final? We yeah. shouldn't really Paniotis be doing in- this. With player uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Who is player 1, 2, 3, 4, 5? Is it Nazaros as well? No. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I think he's the slowest player I know on Warlight. In a real-time game. You mean Bob? No. I don't know. I'm, don't I'm pretty Bob. slow as well. <laughs> Both the Greeks got knocked out in the semi-finals. Greece is going to hell. (laughs) (sighs) Hurry up, Paniotis. Yeah, surrender already. Is there a plot? Yes. Is there a what? Again. Did you leave again? Did I leave? I didn't leave. The multi-day ladder. Yeah, I'm not in it right now. Oh, Pia! <laughs> Join so, it! Nah, I, 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 I didn't like some of the games I had there. They were too lame. <laughs> <laughs> we're finally up to 80 players again. Yay! We've been at 80 since 2017, so... I reckon I can make it down just a bit. four seconds before I was, bo- I was gone up to get booted. Sorry. You got I booted? No, I was thinking so much about the last turn. But you uh, almost got put it. It it went really good though. I think. I think. <laughs> you should write on the chat that he should surrender his world. That always works for me, so you should give it a try. Okay. <coughs> yeah, the number of players might be might go down on the MDL um, when during Con League. Yeah, but it, it normally fluctuates and, you know, it uh, holds steady at around, like, 77, 78, so... What's the most amount of players you've had on it? At one time? Uh, yeah. I think we've had uh, maybe 84, 85. 84, okay. Now, but in total, we've had quite a few, actually. People come and go. Any yeah, we- any update on that thing you were discussing with Fizza? When you got to 2K no, games or something? I haven't really had a chance to talk to him. Or rather, he hasn't had a chance to talk to me. Are you, <laughs> a, most are of you allowed to say what it is? No, actually, so we were just talking about how to get, uh, like, you know, community events, uh, more visibility in general on Warlight, and, like, you yeah. know, because um, I keep bumping into a lot of players who don't know about, about the existence of things like, you know, the multi-day ladder or the promotion relegation league. Yeah. And, like, I mean, there is a lot of, uh, like, you know, uh, there are a lot of threads on the forums in general, but, like, well, these most, of these, but most of these threads are, uh, like, you know, notable. And I don't know how people don't know about them. So, like, they either don't go on the forums at all. That's one way, like, you know, that's one reason why they don't know anything about them. Yeah. But other than that, I don't see how they, they're not aware about its existence, but it's still true. And like, I keep meeting a lot of these kind of people. And when they see it, they're like, you know, wow, why didn't, why don't I know about it? And it's yeah. been quite a while since like, you know, these competitions have been going. Like the promotion okay. relegation league is in its 20th season or something, 21st yeah. season or something like that. And like for someone not to know about it and who's an old player is crazy. But so, yeah, I, I mean, like the... Co- the only thing yeah. I can suggest is um, try and just speak to as many clan leaders as possible and get them all to yeah. post it in their clan forums. Because it's just, it's word of mouth really that things spread, you know, that news spreads of events and stuff. Yeah. Just, just hire there, Sticks there as your PR manager and she'll take care of it. Yeah. But there are still <laughs> a lot of uh, like players who are not in clans as such. And yeah. like if you look at the one v one ladder, there's like 
a lot of players like you know there are like about 400 odd players joined on the 1v1 ladder and not really all of them have clans and it's about somehow targeting those players as well because yeah. like those are the players who never go on forums you know who don't really know about i don't know how they found the 1v1 ladder in the first place <laughs> but, <laughs> that's true however they so, did like that how were you discussing with Fezzer about how, how how are you going to discuss with Fezzer about how to get the so, the events more noticeable. So we have uh, like the community events section right today, and that has like, I guess it has about five entries which are visible, and the rest are hidden, and you have to click a button to like see them mm-hmm. on the community page. But that's probably not as noticeable as say having a tab on the like you have five ladders right now, right? So yeah. say you had another tab there, I think that would be much more noticeable. Yeah, definitely. So that would be a good idea. That's, that's one way to do it. Another way to do it were, would be like how we used to have WGL announcements in the past where uh, you could uh, basically, like, you know, if you were on Warlight when WGL was happening, you would see a pop up saying, hey, there's a WGL right now. Just uh, yeah. go on over to like join it. Okay. If we could do stuff like that. Uh, obviously it shouldn't be spammy because then people get put off but Mm -hmm. like you know those kind of things once in a while like say once in a month or once in two months something like that just to like you know make sure that people who don't use the forums at all are aware about it that would be good yeah cool but I don't know how keen he is on that. Uh, we actually haven't had a conversation Um, well to be honest he um, he, he has mentioned um Final in is a, done. In a couple of his streams where he'd yeah. like to get that kind of thing more noticeable, so it's definitely worth approaching him. Yeah. Actually, final I think he said. Final is uh, done. Okay. <laughs> the final. I think he said that uh, he wanted to talk about it, but he just hasn't found time yet. So I guess. Yeah, just grab him on. He's, he's supposed to be streaming today, uh, later. I don't know what time. But yeah, I think it'll be around. Him, I think that's the best time to grab him on the stream. <coughs> So, shall we go over the final? Yep. Yes. Panagiotis, do you want to go over your picks? Yeah. I went for 1-2 at uh, plus 3 FTB. It was so safe and the best uh, for FFTB at the distribution. Mm-hmm. Uh, then 3-4 at the plus 2, again FTB. Uh, I needed a quick income, so I decided to go for those 3-4. Then five for plus one uh, at the south, uh, which is quite good pick in my opinion, because it provides a plus one really fast, and I think I need it at this uh, distribution. And then six, seven, eight at the plus two ping south, mm-hmm. and eight the counter at them. Okay, I think they look pretty good. Yeah, I like the one too. You might be ignoring a bit Al Kasim, which is also first turn bonus, but um, I think that's okay. Yeah, but the uh, I four can counter it easily. In my yeah. Okay, let's take a look at player one to three four five. Player one to three four five has his first pick in the south in Najran, then two three in uh, Shamal Ash Sharkia. Uh, his fourth pick is in the south again to combo. Um, the south, then there's five in Al Qasim, is six and seven around uh, the plus two in the center, then the eight all the way up there in Turaif. I don't understand the eight at all. Yeah, me too. Uh, maybe he has the two, if he has the two, he can do some sort of combo with the eight. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. I don't like it. So, Master of the Dead, you haven't actually commentated any game so far, so what do you think? Um, I think uh, the Shamal Asharikya bonus is like very OP here because of the wasteland in Hasi. It's mm-hmm. like so if you if you miss out on that combo, you've like basically lost that uh, income for the whole game because I don't think you can break it. Mm-hmm. Uh, 
And so I think player one, two, three, four, five picks in that regard are a bit risky because he goes two, three, which doesn't guarantee a pick there. Because if he gets his first pick, Paniotis could sneak uh, that FTP all for himself. Mm-hmm. Um, but he does have a pick in Al Kasim, which I'm guessing is his latest counter to the to missing a two, three. But um, I don't know if he will actually ever manage to break it. And uh, the combo on Najran in the south is probably risky because it can be countered. Although I don't yeah. think Paniotis actually ends up countering it. So maybe it'll work out for him. Um, but yeah, I just feel that FTB in the the three FTBs like OP. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think uh, Bob had better picks here. So let's see what they mm-hmm. got. And yeah, they split the um, the green plus three. Oh yeah, uh, one, two, three, four, five. It's lucky to get oh, yeah, a good that was position. He could have easily have lost both of those. Yep. Yep. Uh, yeah. Also, the the one four was pretty risky because of the counters. Yeah, but yeah. that worked out as well. So. Okay, so shall we play this and see what happens? I'm gonna play the game starting now. Actually, I think player 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 has an advantage on picks here. Because he gets He's gonna get plus 4 at least on first turn. Mm -hmm. And uh, Bob will only get plus 3 overall. Uh, He should also enter... Oh, that's a big mistake. He should enter Jubali here. He goes into Al... What yeah, but Al-Hofuf counters might do. Oh yeah, counters on the south. What? Okay. Yeah, it- but see, why not go into uh, Jubali and blockade it? Because, so the al yeah. whatever, al riyadh uh, that bonus is eventually in the long term easy to break. You just need to ensure you stop uh, Shamal Ashariqiya. And then he does some something pretty weird. Going yeah. To, to no idea what's going on there. Yeah, actually. he expected you to have that pink three bonus, I think. Yeah. yeah. But I really don't know why. Yeah. Yeah, I think he had this, but uh, he must have turned two a bit. Still not over though. He has a good shot. I think he makes the right choice in deciding to just give up. Uh, that fo- actually maybe no. He could have he could have tried to hang on and just take the double border in Lima. But he decides to give up Wasat Asharikya altogether. Yeah. I'm probably butchering all of these names. Yeah, so are <laughs> we, so it's okay. Yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> I forgot to make a delay at 10-4 from my south plus one. <laughs> Did it matter? No. I, I I really like that you didn't go from Jubali hard into Ad uh, Damam on turn three because that allows you to transfer back and save your double water threat. Yeah. So that was good. Uh, that was what I thought and did uh, attack only. What the hell is he doing? <laughs> oh no. Oh, he expected uh, you to take uh, the four bonus. Uh, right. Yeah. I think, yeah, that's over prediction. I, I would have probably tried to go for the four, so I think it was a decent prediction. But you still have a double border on the four, so if, if it really ca- came to that, you can break it later. I think yeah, you have to press what is in front of you as opposed to, you know, trying to over predict sometimes. Well, I think yeah. he was also trying to protect his double border as well. Yeah, true. Yeah, if I lost my plus three, uh, then it would be eight versus seven. Yeah. So I really needed to, to defend it. Eight versus nine, actually. Because you... Um, uh, yeah, yeah. He has two, two bonuses in the south, so... 
But yeah, the moment he loses uh, Lima, I think it's done. Yeah, that was a bad one to lose. After that yeah. game was probably all. Oh, he smashes a big stack into Lima as well. Ouch. Yeah, this game is yeah, over. Game's definitely over. <laughs> One Ow. more turn, just to stall us a little bit more. Um. Yeah, I don't see the need for that extra turn, to be honest, but... It's only one, isn't it? Okay, so congratulations, Bob, on winning WGL number 149. Thank you. Uh, Good job. Thank you, everyone, for participating. Let's take a quick look at who won the, um, the predictions without showing emails this time. I always end up doing this thing where I show the emails of everyone, which Yay, is not nice. Won. You won? Really? I did. <laughs> Congratulations. Oh, I thought you predicted... Uh, uh, you didn't predict Bunny or just to win the final. No, but I don't think anyone did apart from... Oh, Min. 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 Yeah. Uh, you you wow, didn't win. Min, Min, Min 24 a... won. I wish I had predicted myself to win. Yeah, oh, he has 60 refreshed. points. I refreshed and ah, uh, now it's ah, oh, damn. Ah. <laughs> awesome. You got I'm second place first though, first does that count oh. for something? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> so congratulations, Min44. Uh, you win the predictions of WGL number 149. And that's it. I did predict something right though, that you didn't die. I, I, I didn't die on the first round. <laughs> it's close you know enough. I mean, of your man flu, of your man flu. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> not yet. I probably died like six times, but not all nine, so I guess that's okay. So, um, <laughs> I gotta put this a little bit to the left so you guys can see the full bracket. Yeah. Okay, so I think that's it for today's WGL. I'm tired as hell. I'm sick. I'm dying. So uh, goodbye, everyone. Thank you for uh, commentating. Uh, Glam, Stixie, uh, Jefferson, and Panagiotis, and MOTD who also arrived later, but he did arrive. And uh, yeah, see you next time. Uh, maybe one month from now. Well, who knows? So bye bye, everyone. Take care. Yeah, bye, guys. Bye. Yeah.